Hey everyone, Rarity Dash here, and it's time for another reaction request. If you have a video that you'd like me to react to, check the description below. There's a link that will take you to a Google document with all the relevant information. So today I'll be looking at a full playlist of short videos from Gooseworks. I looked at one Gooseworks video before, the Little Runmo, which I really liked. I thought that was a very good video. Really enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, now we're looking at a full playlist of five short videos from Gooseworks. I'm not sure how they're connected, but I'm sure that they are because they're on this playlist, and this playlist is an official playlist from Gooseworks, so gotta be some sort of connection. And I can see right here, actually, we have a repeating character name. So, um, yeah. Interested to see what this is all about, uh, and excited to dive in, so let's just get started with this first video here. Uh, and I, I forgot to say, the, the playlist is titled The Pink City. Um, and this first one is uh, Elaine, the bounty hunter? I don't know. <laughs> Usually Elaine has an E at the end, but uh, so there might be some other way to say it when it doesn't, but uh, maybe we'll find out. Let's get started. <laughs> Your target today is an infamous crook that goes by Gop Doncer? He's on for 12 cases of snipping and 57 cases of snapping. I trust one of you two to bring him in alive. Okay. Interesting character designs. Now good luck and have fun. We might not ever learn how to say that, because <laughs> it doesn't seem like there's much voice acting going on so far. Oh. Well? That went well. A very unusual looking character. Don Sterling. And there he is. Again, a very odd-looking character. Oh. Well? Definitely saw you coming there. Oh. Well, I guess that's, uh... <laughs> a means to catch up, just... Hop in a random car. Oh boy. Yeah. Oh wow. <laughs> Where are those coming from? This has a limitless supply. Oh, or maybe not. Uh, and then you just haven't done that on you. Like, I... Oh, great job. Uh, sucks to be that guy. Oh. Yeah, oh god. Uh, well, I guess our... Uh, wow, okay, <laughs> I guess our character here is pretty durable. Burgatory. Love it. Who doesn't want to go to Burgatory? <laughs> yeah, I mean, if I was this guy, I'd be surprised to see you too, because after all that, that's uh, a lot to recover from. Oh, okay, we're just... I... Huh.
How well do you really know me? Where did I not really... Okay, the quiz time! I... <laughs> I would guess, I mean, that seems like the best vacation, but no. Of course it's wrong. Like, mines and green slime don't really scream vacation. The hunter found. Oh, wow. Okay. Does this one look familiar to you? No. Yeah. So it is a her. Well, that was interesting. Not sure. <laughs> The CEO of Pointiness. I love the names. The driver. Bumby Bombo Bibabomb. Him know the minimum wage worker. <laughs> all those characters in cages have names, but I'm not done. But I'm not reading all of that documentation. Dennis. Invisible. O. Every. Love it. Yeah. Invisible O is my favorite character. Well, that was fun. Where does it go from here? Okay, yeah. Okay, still stuck. In Spectrum the business is made to work the way small business works. Made to deliver award winning security technology. Made to connect and protect every device. And made to keep your business network your business. Spectrum business made to work. Alright, back to this place. Is he finally going to get out? Wow. Yeah, that's, uh, that's gonna hurt. That is a long staircase. I don't know what functional purpose that could have. I, 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 I mean, I, I guess this is an imaginary scenario, right? So, probably shouldn't overthink it, but, uh, it's just a little bit ridiculous. Okay, how long is this going to be the whole... Video for this one? Four minutes or just this guy falling? I mean, I'm there for it if that's the case, but... And the music's not bad. At least we're getting zooms and different angles sometimes. Oh, now it's color changing. Oh, yeah, 
that's a very different angle. <laughs> Some silhouette action. Stairs, indeed. That's kind of interesting. <laughs> Not that it isn't amazing, but it has gone on for a while. Ouch. Okay. The stairs are done. Yeah. Yeah, maybe don't do that. What were the other scenarios? <laughs> ghost of the Year. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome oh, this one's got to the 57th Annual Ghost of the Year. We've got a plethora of ghosts to choose from here. Who is Boogie? City, but only one can be crowned the winner. But first, let's meet our bodacious panel of judges. Hailing all the way from Fuzzner Circus City, we have the exotically illiterate Mr. Squeeze. Hello, everybody. This is Squeeze. Hi, Mr. Squeeze. And beside him, we have <laughs> all the way from. <laughs> and uh, last, okay. But not least, we have nobody. There is no third judge, <laughs> and there was never going to be. Interesting. Who are you? Surely. They have four judges, Lester. I wonder if they lost their budget because of that horrible tragedy. Euster. Our first ghost honest. is one that's been terrorizing the Pink City for generations upon generations. So only this guy talks, and I guess the audience. Generations upon generations upon generations upon generations upon generations upon generations. Scug! This bloated ghoul is known okay. for sneaking up on unsuspecting victims and blaring its boisterous bellow right in their ear. Oh, yeah, okay. Well, I that's, know yeah. I wouldn't want to get caught in that ghost's line of fright. Me neither. Yeah, definitely all about the sound there. Our next ghost, invisible O, is a fan oh. favorite among stupid yes. people. <laughs> primary Suddenly, I feel called out. Invisible. Oh. But, while not entirely dangerous on her own, she's known to form grudges easily, and will spend long okay. periods of time stalking her victims. This includes being generally obnoxious, like knocking things out of her victims' hands, or bumping into them at inopportune moments. Still wanted, that's great. We normally wouldn't rate her Got appearance, given how she's invisible, but the technology of the Mark V Visabismo has allowed us to take this rare photo, revealing Invisible O in action. Okay, well that's a look. I, uh... Dangerous. Ghost number okay. three, Ghoulius Ghoulius. This ghost is an ambush spirit, the most dangerous ghost class. Julius has been reported to fly out at its victims and spin them violently until they regurgitate. Okay. Now let's see the marvelous Spectre in action. Yeah! 
Wonderful. This one's pretty dangerous. So approach with caution and approach with caution. Yeah, I mean spookiness indeed. Our fourth ghost is Von Herustus. This strange ghost likes to prop itself up in vacant areas, like empty parking garages and dried up swimming pools. Thankfully, the typical lack of foot traffic around this beast prevents frequent civilian encounters, which we should all be thankful for. Von Herustus has the quite peculiar ability of making anyone who passes through it permanently forget the name of the person they care about most. Even okay. If being reminded, the victim will always forget again within a matter of minutes. Wow, well, that's uh, that's yeah. Kind of funny. I, I don't know. <laughs> it's a bit. And our final ghost. A bit is, messed up. Uh, um, uh, well, I don't remember its name, but it spits goo on you or something. I'm bored. Roll the clip. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Um, okay, well, I don't know. <laughs> Spin Dimpy, okay. Judges, uh, oh. have you made up your minds? Okay, I think I'd still vote I invisible. Oh. Night where we find out which of these horrifying ghosts will be our ghost of the year. The f was that? All right, the ghost of the year is. I don't think we know much about old Dusty Doug. Maybe that's a good thing too. Yeah. Might have made a mistake with that judge there. <laughs> now we're never gonna find out who the winner was, yeah. The ghosts were lame this year anyway. I don't know, I mean, I, th I thought there were some pretty interesting concepts in there. Uh, oh, okay. Doesn't look like it ended very well for Honus there. Although maybe he'll be able to be Ghost of the Year next year. Mr. Sweeze was the only one unharmed at the scene of the disaster. The investigation is ongoing. Oh, what's too bad about Invisible O? Wow, <laughs> this is new. Yeah, switch to H and R Block. Doing my own taxes like a champ. You can. Okay. Next, we got the long one, which is Elaine gets adopted. Okay, finally out. Just had to wait. For it to get repaired. But their name no longer works here. And back to the underground. Smooth butter bakery by the Gander Grind. I do love that song. By the way, there's been reports of a scary looking bulky fellow injecting people with unknown substances. So keep your eyes peeled and stay safe on those streets. Today's weather was a lovely combination of wet and dry, with high temperatures in the low 50s and low temperatures. Oh. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, those are some teeth. Dyslexic lemons?
Yeah, I don't think I'd be very happy about this if I was her. Mocks. Oh. Wasp? I can't find me. <laughs> okay. And this guy's wanted. <laughs> the wanted poster for the other guy's still up, too. And there he is! Oh. Okay. Oh, and this guy! Is he going to... I mean, he took care of that one ghost. Okay, some, some bad history here, I'm guessing. Tax Galaxy. <laughs> oh. Guess you got him. He's <laughs> really being treated like a dog. Oh, I guess he, okay, he didn't die. Oh, okay, well that's, uh... Uh, wow. Surprised that thing still has any battery. Maybe... <laughs> iPads are just much more efficient in this world. <laughs> Is one of them just a door? Yeah, yeah, that eye. Something about it. Nuzner Fubs. Yeah, this is... Ooh. Right in the eye. This is about to get trippy. Yeah. Yeah. Time for a trip.
<laughs> oh god. <laughs> I mean, this series is already so weird that a drug-induced hallucination doesn't really make it that much weirder. <laughs> Aww. Aww. <laughs> he misses her. Yeah, doesn't still have her phone. Not that she'd be able to answer the call anyway right now. All these considered, but... Oh. And this guy. Okay, yeah, he's powerful. I thought he just had the guns. But he kind of... Oh, is he the one? Oh, he's an Aldecro, I guess. It's his, uh... Watcher. Oh, and he's got a lot of them. Um. Huh. Okay, that's a uh, odd thing to keep under your hat. Also, not really sure how that's going to help. Do not like the teeth. Oh. Okay. Nice. <laughs> okay, it just makes mushrooms. <laughs> cool. Oh. Yeah, he definitely has the strength advantage here. Uh. Oh, well that probably helps. Yeah, I mean, if he's tripping out, that's a good chance to... Uh, oh! It's a, it grows into a gun! Wow, okay, I guess that's a good thing to keep around then. Let's take some time. And he looks kind of dead. Oh, okay. And he's got a black hole inside of him. Wonderful. Because <laughs> of course he does. Yeah, this is what I was saying before about this <laughs> this show not or this uh, series, this playlist not needing the hallucinogenic drugs. It kind of just does that on its own.
Uh, well, that's not good. I think she needs that. <laughs> I. Okay, yeah, this is way trippier than the drug trip. Why do we confirm that? I mean, he looked pretty dead. So. Oh. Okay, well, she got out of that, I guess. Still a bit concerned about the heart thing, but... You yeah, kind of be into the punch here. Oh. <laughs> Somehow he fits. Now, honestly, you're kind of... Stealing Elaine's kill there. I mean, she's a bounty hunter too, so. <laughs> Could have used that. Oh. Oh. And of course, it's the trash can that her phone was in. <laughs> yeah. yeah, fair, very fair. Fun. Love nugget. Playlist. Oh, no. Try my old spice. You can use it on your pit's chest and. The Darley Boxman Show. <laughs> Starring Darley Boxman. Mim Lim Mim. Milk Fish. Okay. Hey kids, welcome back to the show. I'd do the normal thing and catch you up on what we've been doing out here, but there's simply no time. Isn't that right, Milk Pooch? Oh. We don't have to do this right now if you're really not feeling up for it. <laughs> okay. Why are you so mad at me? Okay, that's it, you little son of a bitch! <laughs> okay, no more milk pooch. Uh, oh. And I guess, uh... The Illuminati is watching? Zendamina. That must be why milk pooch was so Concrete rude to me. Concrete temples. What in 
the sweet and sour f does that mean? Also, how did Milk Pooch get back so fast? Guess we won't be able to get it unless we use the Darley Boxcar! Uh, okay. Hello, not Thomas the Dank Engine. No treasure after all. Well, you definitely look like you can trust this guy. You must follow me over this hill for the lake you desire. All right, guys. Oh. I don't think the incident of a train look like that. <laughs> oh, darling boss man. Will I ever be as good oh. a host as you? Oh! This guy. I wouldn't remember this if I were you. Oh. Well, that one was weird. That was only tangentially created a bit uh, connected to the others, too. Interesting. <laughs> There's that face again. Oh, that's wonderful. Um, yeah, so those are our five videos in this playlist. We don't need this ad. Um, okay, yeah, yeah. That, some pretty cool stuff. Um, I mean, I especially liked the ones featuring Elaine, the starting one, and then the long one where then gets adopted. Like those were my favorites. Uh I mean Dento takes the stairs was there's not wasn't really much to that one. That one didn't seem as essential, but it was, I guess, amusing uh in concept. Uh and I liked Ghost of the Year. I think that was good too, and kind of tied the others together in a weird way. That that kind of felt like a good interstitial thing between the two Elaine ones, uh, even though it wasn't directly related to the same characters exactly, uh, it still felt like a vital piece uh, in a weird way, even though it had a lot of stuff there. Like, who was Shirley in the, the fish? Like, we never returned to them. Uh, but, uh, yeah, that was a good video, too. Really amusing, the concept with the ghosts and the weird judge. Uh... <laughs> And then I guess, I mean, we can we return to that host guy with the Darley Foxman show. Uh, but I'm not sure I see that one as as vital. It's also a weird thing to end on. Uh, <laughs> just overall very strange. Um, and really no resolution to it. So, like, I, I, don't, I don't know. 
I don't know what to make of that one. But I really like the lane stuff, especially Elaine gets adopted. That, def- that definitely felt like the feature here. Like, I mean, it was the longest. It was also the most interesting, I feel. Uh, had the most character to it. Um, yeah, I'm definitely very impressed with Gooseworks overall. Uh, I, I mean, I feel like still Little Romo was my favorite video that I've uh, I've seen so far from Gooseworks. I think that one had the strongest concept of the whole video game thing. Uh, it definitely felt like a very effective standalone, and I really, really like that one. But uh, these were good, too. These were really, really uh, cool videos. And, uh, yeah, I'd definitely be down to watch some more stuff from Gooseworks. I think Gooseworks has a popular series going right now that people are talking about. Uh, yeah, this amazing digital circus. I know nothing about that, but um, I, I, I see that name flying around sometimes. So I guess that's something that's been seeing some success from Gooseworks here. Uh, but these videos that I've seen so far that aren't that uh, <laughs> have been pretty cool. So I can see where maybe that success came from. Um, yeah, because I could definitely see a project from this creator really taking off because there's a lot of innovative stuff here, a lot of interesting stuff, and the animation's cool, and uh, it's just entertaining. It's got a nice quirkiness to it, and uh, yeah, yeah, I can definitely see the appeal of this creator, so uh, good stuff. Anyway, hope you guys liked the reaction. Let me know if you did, and see you in the next one.